four, five, six, seven like individual wreaths put together. And then the honeycomb is like a different type of fabric on top of the canvas. So it is a little bit more expensive. That's why I decided to do it as a kit. All right. So I paired it up with these pretty little sunflowers. Make sure we get all of our flowers towards the front. Y'all, this is gonna be so quick and easy. Get that pulled off. All right. Now I'm going to get mine where it goes directly behind it. Right? So it's literally sitting directly behind, directly behind that stem. That's where I'm going to zip tie it. So I'm going to use the board on the honeycomb to hide it. Can't find the kit? Go to decoexchange.com and type in WK-14. It's not showing up on the site. Well, that's rude. Get that tightened up. Shows it's there, shows it has a quantity, and available. All right. Y'all, now I'm gonna just work some of my flowers back all the way around. I want some going down, some coming back up. I want some of these greens down here. Um, the honeycomb by itself is going to stay sold out because I took them all for, I took them all the kit. All right. Got that done. Y'all. Enough ribbon for a little bow. All right, I'm going to do about a six inch loop. Yeah, people are buying it, so it's there. Y'all, let's do about five and a half inches on that loop. How wide is the honeycomb? It's big. 24. All right, so y'all, just five and a half inch loops, tails. It's 
slide our little bow off. Y'all, this is one that I had planned to make as a multiple on Etsy and just sell a ton of them. But let me be honest, I don't have time. I don't have time. So I might as well let y'all do it. All right. So I'm going to get my bow right in here. I'm going to attach it to that flower stem. Y'all, with this one, because you pay so much for the honeycomb, we don't want to hide the whole honeycomb with flowers and ribbon and all the things, okay? So we want to make sure that the honeycomb stays the center of attention and that we give it just a fun little accent piece. Let's trim our ribbon. Y'all, just the honeycomb was um, $48. So that's why we don't want to hide it. Like let's let's make sure that people see it. Get our tails going the right way. All right, our door hanger is up here. We want our tails all this way. All right, y'all, then we're just gonna take one cute little bee, getting more of the bees, the wicker bees. Nope, those are all gone. We should have more of these. Y'all, we gotta get this sticker off. Y'all, after this, after this, We'll get off here and we'll go live and we'll go look at the warehouse. Y'all got to see all the new stuff. There's just boxes and boxes and boxes of new supplies. It's a little bit crazy. And I'm a little bit sad that I'm leaving and I can't play with all of them. All right. Y'all, so I'm going to take my little bee and I'm going to give him a nice little curve. That way, whenever I work it into the bush, he's like 3D. Here's our top. All right, I'm gonna work him through the grapevine so he has a little bit more stability. And then I'll get him zip tied down there. So y'all, I just zip tied that stem uh, in the honeycomb. All right, now I want this bee to look like he's like flying around the flower and the honeycomb. So cute.
Now, y'all, whenever you get the bees, his wings are like this. Don't leave them, y'all. Don't leave them like that. We're gonna wanna separate those wings to make him look a little bit more fun. All right, y'all, that's it. Quick and easy. I like it. I'm going list this one for sale. Uh, if you want one, snag one out the shop and check out all of the new supplies.